Hello friends, I wanted to show you a new yarn I have. It all started with this right here. And isn't that gorgeous? So I bought three of these. I used one of them in a project and absolutely fell in love. This is 100% wool. The brand name is Chopel, S-C-H-O-P-P-E-L, it's German. And this is called Edition 3, okay? But if you go on yarn.com and look for Edition 3, you will find this. And I have absolutely fallen in love. So, got that, used it, loved it, which led me to buying these two last time. And really, is this not the best thing ever? I mean, this one is like a little rainbow. <laughs> Now, what I first showed you is a 50 gram ball. This is a 100 gram ball, and that one is 100% wool. This one is 75% wool, 25% nylon. What I love about that is that the nylon gives it the strength to be used as a warp yarn on the loom, and the wool is what you get all these amazing colors because wool dyes so beautifully. So, absolutely fell in love. And look at the green. Oh my gosh, everything is in here. Everything, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, so this is Zouder Ball Crazy, 100 gram balls, and this is a, a wool nylon blend. And the little ones, edition three, this is 100% wool. This is a 50 gram, 100 gram, 50 gram, okay? So if you're looking for a small project, you know, head for the edition three. If you're looking for something a little bit more substantial, go for the Zouder Ball Crazy. They're so Okay, so when I find a good thing, I go back and get more because I never really know if it's a fluke, if it's because, you know, because sometimes I have found really and truly gorgeous yarn that was a closeout. And so I pay attention. If I find something that I think is absolutely stunning, I buy more. Okay, so let me show you what I got. <laughs> My bag just came and we've got little ones, edition three, and look at these colors. This, I think, I'm gonna have to weave something to go with the sweater. It, you guys, I'm gonna use one for warp and one for weft. It's gonna be glorious. I can't wait to see how that comes apart together. And then, the next stays there. I put all of my variegates at the top because I, the pure tones are here. Um, this is um, a black, white, gray combination, and it's really pretty. Now, this is not my colorway. <laughs> this is not something I usually do. However, I actually would like to weave a kind of tweed, black and white, and gray piece of cloth because my little dog's name is Coco, inspired by Coco Chanel, and I actually kind of like to weave a, a piece of cloth that kind of looks a little bit like some of the, the woven cloth that Chanel uses. So that's why I have this. And again, have one ball for the warp and one ball for the weft. So that is a project coming your way. Oh my goodness. You guys! <laughs> Princess Leah ears. No, look at this, it matches my hair. Um, these are beautiful. Okay, so pink, lavender, all the girly tones are in here. <laughs> I like that it's not very tonal. The, the, the tones are kept pretty pure. Again, Zelda Ball Crazy. Love, love, love. Substantial 100 gram balls. This is going to be fun. And where are we going to put you? I think right here. That's going to be fun. What else do we have? <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Ooh, yes. Ha ha ha. Okay. This is glorious. The thing about getting a uh, fresh yarn in right when you're in the middle of a project is that I have the urge to cut that one off of my loom so I can get going. Uh, I won't do that. I'm not big on wasting yarn, but I am absolutely looking forward to diving into these. And I think there were a couple of other colorways that I've been really happy to bring home as well. 
they have a little thing on the website where you can enter your email address and they'll let you know when that color's back in stock. And that, my friends, is what came from Yarn Santa Claus. <laughs> yeah, I did, I paid real money for this. This is not a gift, okay? Um, mm. Gorgeous, aren't they? Aren't they gorgeous? Wow, it's just so pretty. We've got a new puppy in the house, so it's more important than ever that they don't go jumping off the wall. <laughs> be along for the ride as I showed you some of the new things that have just come in. Um, that will make it, having these beautiful additions to the collection is going to make it that much harder to decide what I do next. What do I weave next? I mean, I will, uh, <laughs> there's so much possibility so much potential i love being surrounded by potential and color and joyfulness it's just so good so thanks for sticking around leave me a comment and tell me which one you would knit with first or crochet or weave let me know which one you've fallen in love with okay thanks for watching i really appreciate it